Are you looking for the best heart rate monitors? In this video we will look at some of the 6 best heart rate monitors on the market. Before we get started with our video. We have included links in the description. So make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. Starting at number 1. Polar H10 Heart Rate Monitor. When runners think of a standalone heart rate monitor, odds are they think of the Polar H10, a virtually iconic chest strap monitor that's known for superb accuracy, a comfortable fit and all-around versatility thanks to Bluetooth and ANT Plus compatibility. It would be fair to say that unless you have unique needs, the Polar H10 is an all-around good choice. If you don't like changing batteries, you're in luck, because the H10 has about 400 hours of life, which could easily add up to 6 months or more of use, like most heart rate monitors, it uses a non-rechargeable button battery. It also has enough built-in memory, so you can store a workout locally, that lets you leave your phone at home as long as you sync it after the session is over. It's also waterproof and stays firmly in place when you're swimming. If there's anything you might not like about the H10, it's that you need to wet the electrodes before putting it on, and you'll want to store the sensor disconnected from the strap to keep it from running down the battery. At Number 2. Garmin HRM Tri Heart Rate Monitor. It's a little more expensive than the run-of-the-mill heart rate monitor, but the Garmin HRM Tri is laser-focused on a very specific niche dedicated triathletes who are already invested in a Garmin wearable like a Garmin Forerunner 945 or Phoenix 6. That's because this HRM works with ANT plus only no Bluetooth. But in exchange, you get an accurate, comfortable chest strap monitor that is just as good at tracking your heart rate underwater as above. That's not something every heart rate monitor can claim. It comes with a generous amount of onboard memory, 20 hours, to store all your data while you're underwater or just not wearing your watch and syncs automatically when back in range. It tracks a lot more than just heart rate, to a concoction of cadence, vertical oscillation and ground contact time is worth its weight in gold for runners who can interpret the data to eke out better performance. And Garmin estimates you'll only need to change the battery about once every 10 months. At Number 3. Wahoo Ticker X Heart Rate Monitor Chest Strap the Wahoo Ticker X is a versatile heart rate monitor that stores up to 50 hours of data, so you can go weeks without carrying your phone or downloading your data and despite having more than twice as much memory as the Garmin HRM Tri, it's a lot cheaper. That's probably because you can't swim with it, but you can track cycling in addition to running, where you can track metrics like cadence, vertical oscillation and ground contact time in addition to your heart rate. The Ticker X isn't notable just for its onboard storage. It has dual ANT Plus and Bluetooth connectivity, and has the advantage of supporting up to three Bluetooth connections at once. With about 500 hours of battery life, you might be able to go a full year before you have to swap out the battery. It also includes some thoughtful conveniences, like status LED lights that let you see at a glance if the HRM is on or off. Track efficiency and improvements in form. Using Wahoo Fitness app, TickRex can report running dynamics. Vertical oscillation, cadence and ground contact time combine to provide a running smoothness score. Record workout data with the Wahoo Fitness app and automatically upload data to your favorite training platform like Strava. Works with 50-plus apps including Wahoo Fitness, Zwift, Runtastic, Runkeeper, UA Record, Endomondo, Peloton, Map My Run. At Number 4. Apple Watch Series 6, GPS, 40mm. Apple's latest smartwatch is a viable heart rate monitor, though like all wrist-mounted fitness bands and smartwatches, it uses an optical sensor which is generally less accurate than the electrical pulse sensor you'll find in chest straps. Positioned way out at the end of your swinging arms, the watch has to contend with a lot more motion, vibration, and noise than a chest strap. Even so, it's more than accurate enough for casual use, and works with most iOS fitness apps. If you need an ANT Plus connection, you're out of luck. The real reason to get an Apple Watch Series 6 is for the smorgasbord of features it delivers in addition to the HRM, it includes an SpO2 sensor for blood oxygen level readings, an ECG to test for atrial fibrillation, fitness tracking, sleep monitoring and all the usual notifications and smart watch features. If you're really serious about training, 
odds are you'll grow dissatisfied with the Apple Watch and get a chest strap eventually anyway. But for casual exercise, the Apple Watch is an easy URI already wearing its solution for Apple users. The most significant downsides, one-day battery life, and the need to carry your phone with you to download heart rate data in real time. At Number 5. Jabra Elite Sport Earbuds. Jabra makes excellent audio gear, and the Jabra Elite Sport Earbuds are solid true wireless earbuds they sound excellent and fit comfortably in most people's ears. But what sets the Elite Sport apart from most similar earbuds is that these have optical heart rate monitors built in, able to read your heart rate through the blood passing through your ears, not unlike the way smartwatches and fitness bands read the blood flowing at your wrist. Jabra didn't invent ear-based HRMs, but these earbuds are among the most accurate and reliable in their class. Like most true wireless earbuds, you need to charge these frequently, you get about 3 hours of runtime, and they can be recharged several times from the charging case, for a total of 9 hours on the go. They're also IP67 waterproof, which is what you'd expect for earbuds designed to be used while exercising. Like any smartwatch or fitness band, this isn't a solution for truly die-hard athletes. Conversely, it's also not the best choice for extensive music listening sessions with its short battery life. But if all you need is a simple HRM for your daily workout, the Jabra Elite Sport can get the job done while doing double duty as earbuds. At Number 6. Wahoo Tickerfit Armband. Not everyone wants to wrap a band around their chest it can be uncomfortable, and some people prefer a solution that attaches to a different part of the body. Wrist-mounted fitness bands are less accurate than chest straps, but there's a a way to compromise, an optical, not electric pulse, armband sensor like the Wahoo Ticker Fit. Not only does it wrap around your arm rather than your chest, it is innovative in other ways. It uses a rechargeable battery, for example. That's a two-edged sword, most chest straps last for many months before you have to replace the battery, while the Ticker Fit has to be recharged every 30 hours or so. And thanks to both Bluetooth and ANT+, you can connect to just about any kind of device. The good news is that in routine use, it's roughly as accurate as most chest bands, so it's a solid alternative for people who want an armband. Just keep in mind that it has no onboard memory, so you'll need your phone with you at all times to record your heart rate data. Record workout data with the Wahoo Fitness app and automatically upload data to your favorite training platform like Strava. Official heart rate monitor of Team INEOS, Bora Hansgro, Katusha Alpeson, Ironman World Champion Jan Fredino, Heather Jackson and American Pro Mountain Biker Sonia Looney.